I hate to say it, but plain and simple, I'm not motivated anymore. What's up everybody, welcome back to another video. So, I had no intentions to make this video, but it was something that I was feeling and something I was talking to my coach about, and he was like, dude, you need to make a YouTube video about this. People need to hear this. And what this is, as you guys know, I'm on week three of you know trying to get lean, trying to get shredded for the summertime, and everything's been pretty good. That first week, obviously, and I'll, I'll go over the reason why. Uh, second week, you know, pretty good. Uh, but this week, you know, has been an absolute struggle. And I woke up on Wednesday morning in the most horrible mood, guys. Like, just mad at the world, mad that I had to do cardio, did not want to do it. And I thought about every excuse under the, underneath the sun to justify not doing my assigned cardio in the morning. Oh, I'm too tired. Oh, I have a lot of work to do. Oh, I'm just too busy. Oh, it's a beautiful day. Let me go outside. Oh, I would love to get some coffee right now. Whatever excuse I could think of, I was like, okay, that, that's why I can't do this cardio. That's why I'm not gonna do this cardio. And then I was like, what am I doing? Like, you, you say you want this bad enough. You, you're on this nine week plan. Why are you not gonna do this cardio? Got on the cardio machine, just pissed, just mad at the world, just doing it, just like so upset. Like, oh, I hate this, I hate life can't believe I have to do this. Why can't I just eat whatever I want? And you know, I started thinking like, if I'm going through this, there has to be other people that feel the same way. Whether that's in business, weight loss, muscle building, whatever that may be, you, you hit that one moment that you just don't want to do anything. And at that moment, nothing could, could save me. Not motivation, not inspiration, no motivational videos, nothing could help me. There was only one thing. And what that one thing was, was discipline. Knowing that I had to do this, knowing that I committed to this, knowing that I committed to you guys and I made this 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 pack with you and so many people in my episode one were like, yo, I'm gonna do this cut with you. Yo, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get on a cardio plan, get on a meal plan, let's get shredded, let's get fit for the summertime. And I felt like I'm letting my people down. I'm, most importantly, I'm letting myself down. And so the only thing that pushed me through was discipline. And so I want to share this, just this low moment with you and just understand, and want you guys to understand that, look, you know, whatever you're going to do, whatever you're going through, whatever weight loss journey you're going through, it's not going to be easy, guys. You're going to have moments like I had, you know, on Wednesday morning where I didn't want to do this anymore. I didn't want to do the cardio. I hate cardio. Like, it's just like me in the morning, like I like to just get up and I have my routine. Like I like to just kind of get settled in, have my cup of coffee, you know, check the scores of the, you know, sports. And I, I started to pick up on, when I start to do that long enough, the longer that goes on, the less and less chance I have of knocking out my cardio because the day starts, things start happening, you know, and your employees start calling you, emails start happening and your chances of knocking out that cardio get less and less. So that's why the, the most important thing for me is I get up in the morning and just get, just get to it. Just get straight to the cardio, knock it out so you don't have to worry about it. And as these weeks go on, cardio is gonna get longer and longer. So I first started off, you know, 20 minutes, 25, 30, now it's up to 40 minutes. So it's a good chunk of the morning time, right? And so I just wanna say after my 40 plus minutes, I end up going longer, but after my 40 plus minutes of cardio, I had never felt so freaking good. I was so happy. Just this feeling of accomplishment. And I talked to my coach about it and he was like, dude, you gotta make a video. So I was like, okay, I'm gonna do it. So that's what I'm doing today, guys. Just sharing with you these up and downs. Like, you know, you're gonna have these ups and downs through these cuts and, you know, weight loss journeys, whatever that may be. You're gonna have those mornings where you don't wanna go wake up. You don't want to uh, go work out. You don't wanna go do your fasted cardio. You don't wanna go do your hit cardio. You don't wanna go do your yoga, your CrossFit, whatever that may be. You don't wanna do that. You'd rather just lay in bed, sleep and just rest and just, you know, skip all that stuff. But I'm telling you, that is the moment where motivation can no longer help you. And the only thing that can get you through that is discipline. You need to make a promise to yourself, create these habits. So when that happens again, you know what? You're like, oh, this is just a feeling. It doesn't matter if I don't feel good. It doesn't matter if I don't want to. It doesn't matter if it's a nice day. It doesn't matter if I have a lot of work. It doesn't matter if I'm tired. 
I made a commitment and I'm gonna stick to this because I'm disciplined. So guys, if you go through this, if you have that same feelings in the morning, if you have that same feeling in the afternoon where you don't wanna go to the gym, you don't wanna go food prep, you don't wanna eat that food that you brought to work and you'd rather go have some pizza or go have some beer with the friends, understand your why, remember your why and remember that commitment you made and build on that discipline because it will only get easier and easier. So now it was funny when I woke up Thursday and this morning, I had that same feeling like, oh gosh, dang it, I just wanna get up and just have a cup of coffee and just chill outside. I don't wanna have to do this cardio, but we you know, we have a 9.30 meeting with, with our whole entire staff. So I get up in the morning, I gotta hurry up and do this cardio because once that 9.30 meeting starts, you're, we're gonna have like tasks throughout the day. So I gotta hurry up and get this cardio done. And I did it and I said, Logan, I know you don't wanna do this. You're mad, but it doesn't matter. Get on that damn cardio machine, get on that damn Stairmaster, get on that treadmill and start moving, start running and just knock it out. And by the midpoint, you know, you kind of get over that feeling. You're not really mad anymore. And by the time you're done and you actually saw that, see that you completed it, you just get this amazing feeling. You just get this awesome feeling of like, hell yeah, I did it. I didn't want to. And you know what, no one cares. Like if you were to tell your friends, you tell your loved ones, whatever, like, oh, I didn't do cardio, they don't care. Like no one cares. The only person that should care is you. And so that's my little update for this week three, guys. I didn't show you any meals. I'll give you an updated meal plan. I'm On the next video, I'm gonna show you a full day of eating on a low carb day. So on my high carb days is what you saw on video one. On the weekends, I don't train, so there's no reason for me to be eating 2,800 calories. So the calories do drop off, the carbs do drop off, and I'll show you how that day looks like in the next video. But just wanted to share this heart to heart with you guys. You know, it's not even for me who's been in this fitness industry for 10 plus years. I've been going through multiple cuts. I've done contest shows. I've done a bodybuilding show. I've run marathons. I've done it all, right? And even still to this day, I have those moments where I don't want to do stuff. I don't. I'm not motivated. I don't want to do what I need to be. What needs to be done. And so I want you to know that even if you have those feelings, you're gonna get those feelings, and that's okay. It's okay. Just understand why you're doing this, why you committed, and, and, and let that discipline take over and say, it doesn't matter how I feel. It doesn't matter if I wanna do it because I'm gonna freaking do it because I made that commitment. I hope this video helped you guys. If you're feeling like me, you're feeling sluggish, maybe you're watching this video and you're like, damn, now I gotta go do my cardio. Now I'm gonna go do my damn cardio. Go do it. If, you have, if you're having that same feeling, you're like, damn, I don't wanna go work out. You're gonna go work out after this damn video. Do what you need to do. Discipline, baby. And if you wanna watch a crazy video, click right here. This is when I used to do the old man diet. That's one meal a day, 3,000 calories. Click right here, check it out.